Hi guys, so today I just want to show you how I um, basically converted this adapter um, as a uh, power supply or, or power adapter for my um, toolkit RCM6 mini and you can basically do this with other chargers like, like this one which doesn't have a uh, built-in power supply where basically this is for field charging where you bring your bigger lipos um, use them as a source to charge your uh, smaller lipos especially for FPV where you'll have a lot of smaller lipos so basically that that is power adapters like this one there's uh, this symbol here like you could you can notice the plus sign going inside the half circle and the the minus sign going outside the half circle now that means um, that the inside pin or the wire that goes uh, in the inside of the circle of this circle uh, connected to the pin is the positive and then the wire going to the side or connected to this one is the negative so that what that means um, but just to be safe uh, it's better to use a multimeter to find out the, the polarity and basically what I did at the end of this I just connected this um, Dean's plug then Dean's plug connected to the um, XT60 to connect to this one you can um, you know directly connect a, an XT60 here I just ran out of XT60s uh, that's why I connected it to the Dean's first and then Dean's to, to this one um, basically that's it and then funny is once I, I did this I actually found this one <laughs> in my parts bin uh, which has a better rating uh, 12 volts 2 amperes compared to this one 12 volts 1.5 amperes I know there's already a video about using a uh, laptop charger uh, typically where laptop chargers are like 20 volts 3 to 5 amps if I'm not mistaken so that's actually better I'm actually gonna eventually buy one when I um, get to a 3 inch or 5 inch quad wherein I'll be using 4S LiPos but right now I'm typically just using 2S and then 3S for my RC crawlers so uh, 12 volts is, is fine with me and slow charging is just okay with me too I don't do parallel charging um, for now we'll see so next will be the basically video on, on how I did it thanks